Hey guys, so here is a quick look at a dark theme that I made for Audacity. Uh, we're just going to look through some of the things that you'll probably see. If we go here to add new stereo track, you can see that um, I've completely flattened everything, pretty much. And I think it makes for an easier you know, user experience when you're editing sound. Um, if we go and record something quickly, I'll show you the waveform. Uh, I'm just going to talk about nothing, just a test, see how it looks, and there we go. And you can see that the waveform, if I normalize it, let me show you. Uh, so as you can see, I've just made it a solid color. Uh, if we add a time track, you'll see that it also has a similar flat design. Um, just made everything dark and given a blue sort of, you know, tint to it. Um, if we add a label track, then it's a bit brighter, but it kind of differentiates between the other tracks for you. Um, if I add a label, I've uh, completely changed the icons, just a, a simple sort of flat design. If I just type something in, uh, I've given it a blue sort of color as well. Um, if we take a look at the uh, previous color scheme, I'll show you what I mean. We had the light version. You can see that it's quite hard to edit in the dark just because it's so bright. So what I did was just completely, you know, inverse the colors. Uh, I think it makes for an easier experience when you're editing sound. So if we go back to custom, there we go. So uh, to install this theme, what you have to do is download Audacity version 2.2 or newer which is on their website so just go there and get it you, uh, this theme i'll link and it's just an image file and you have to place that in um, the app data folder which is in the description and then you go to edit preferences and set the theme back to custom and there you go that's it so yeah i hope you enjoyed this dark theme it uh, hopefully will make audio editing a bit easier for you and that's it really cheers